All right, this is the Ionic Pro air purifier, and um, they need to be taken apart and cleaned. Uh, I do mine. This is the metal piece. I take this and I actually just wash it in a sink instead of just wiping it down. That collects the particles, and you have to literally lay this machine down this way to load that piece in on the floor because it has a lock clip so you can't do it standing up doesn't load right um, this is the base that goes over here and that comes off with four screws the top here has four big long screws and I don't know that I even really needed to take that off and then these two pieces come off. I had to slice this label with a razor blade very carefully uh, so I could separate the two items. And this has four screws here, three, four screws over here. They're little teeny tiny screws, so you have to have a screwdriver and go in here. And they're uh, cross top screws. And you don't want to get any this wet, but I wiped everything down. This is the blade cleaner thing. And it's it's like guitar strings. So you have to uh, wipe those down very carefully. But this thing goes up and down to clean those blades, it's this whole thing on the top. See how that does that to that machine? See where it is? That cleans those little guitar strings. Okay, and then this is the push button system. This is where the screws go down. See for this. Okay. And this is where this unit goes, but you can only do it as it's laying down on its back. And then I wipe all this down. I have to clean these contacts with alcohol and a Q-tip in here, as they were a little bit corrody and dirty. And then this unit here, I cleaned with alcohol and a Q-tip. On top and bottom, it was real dirty. And then I wipe this with a sponge real carefully in here, and I took... This piece and hand washed it. Those other two pieces, the base and the rail. And then I'll put it back together and start it up. And the plug stays stable. You just want to be careful on those boards. You don't want to get any, you know, magnetization or anything like that near there. You don't want to get it wet. Um, and you put it back together and it works so much better. Uh, but that's how you open them and service them. At least that's what I do. Um, before you throw it away because uh, they, they really get dirty uh, through the year and then when these get clogged it's not breathing and not doing what it's supposed to be doing the ionizing where it, it electrocutes and grabs everything onto this um, if this is all clogged up with pet hair and dirt and dust it can't do what it's supposed to do right so I'll, I like to take mine apart about once a year and um, uh, it works pretty good so I hope you enjoyed this and seeing what's inside. This is all the electronics. We'll zoom in here. There's the blade thing. There's the, the connectors for the base of this thing. Uh, and this is all the electronics. It's actually got a board on the bottom. So there you are. Hope you have a really great day and enjoyed that video.